the fully geek. Yes, yes, yes. Welcome everybody to episode 131 of the Fully Geek Pod. Full squad inside. What's happening, boys? What's good? What's good, man? Oh, good, sir. Yeah, good. Everyone's good. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, good, nice good. to see you. I'm not can't complain, man. I can't complain. Yeah. Well, I can, but we're not going to. Do you know what I mean? It's it's the 8th of March today. Um, we're all breathing. The sun was shining today. Chris Eubank said that the sun was shining. It's always a reason to dance. So. Uh, that's that's my that's my new mantra. Although well, it's freezing cold. Nah, yeah, it's it's, 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 like, it's like chilly breeze. It's got, it's got chill. Bro, I'm, on, I'm onto the light jackets and t-shirt, mate. Nah, see, that's not. Nah, 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 nah. You know it's, it's, it's still what he has. It's still what he has. I know, I know, I know. Merv is out there because I, I remember from last year. Merv, Merv's a shorts man. As soon as the sun is shining, Merv. He's popping out shorts, man. He's popping out shorts. He's tricking me. He's tricking me. You see my legs nowadays, yeah. You see, you see the bottom half of me, bro. Oh, oh, Merv went, went, went for one run, yeah? I think he's got... What's his name? What's that footballer's name? Carlos. Bro, Carlos the yeah, bro, Carlos, man. Bro, the man them always want to know, what's going on with the running thing, bro? You told the listeners bro, bro. that, that you, you started running. You ain't never been running since, <laughs> Some, Sometimes, innit? Sometimes you just got a hype in it and just, just tell some black stories and, and it's over, innit? I hear you, I hear you, I hear yeah. you. Yeah, yeah. All right, well, good to see you all back. Good to see you all back. All right, well, let's just get kick off, man. Let's kick off. All right, guys, obviously, um, big news is the war still happening. Um, I guess it is what it is. Um, the only thing I would like to say is that we are re- they are really trying to apply pressure to the Russians. I mean, they're taking away, I'm hearing McDonald's, said they want to stop serving McDonald's over there. Coca-Cola said they would have stopped serving Coca-Cola over there. Everyone's just trying to pull their kind even, of... Even the company that I work for, which I can't say, they're taking all their stuff from there. And like, that's a big thing, bro. Do you know what I mean? It's mental. I yeah. don't understand. They're, they're properly trying to starve them of all money. Yeah. You, reckon, you reckon it's one of those things like, because other organisations have done it, and then they're probably thinking, we, we've got to do this well, isn't it? Because otherwise we'll just be kind of... Exactly. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah basically. They don't look, yeah, like so. look like they're supporting it, basically. Yeah, yeah. I, think, I think everyone's jumping on the bandwagon. Yeah. I think I think the, the government's made it clear, made a clear stand on what... what they kind of set precedent for all the other companies to kind of follow mm. a trend. Mm. I, don't and, know if, I don't know if it helps. I don't know really understand. Yeah, I, I just... And, you know, pull, the, like Tesco's are taking... Russian alcohol off the shelves. I'm like, bro, yeah. what are you doing? Like, come on, I mean, you've already put, you've already paid your tax for it. You've already paid for the bloody products. It's not buy and return. You know what yeah, I mean, we keep it in your uh, warehouse. I don't for? get that. Yeah, exactly. even, even EA have pulled out as well, man. Who? EA like the games, isn't it? The games company. Oh, oh, to, oh, oh EA yeah. Sports. Yeah, or well, not? In well, the game. EA, EA. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, in it. That's like yeah, it's in the sports. Obviously, man plays Sims in it, so they pulled it off. Boy. But any, yeah. any like any existing things that they've got, obviously, it stays there. But anything new, doing any any online stuff. Yeah, and I, I think like don't get me wrong. I think for if it was just against Putin and the Mandem, I, I hear it. But if you're just a common Russian brother that maybe listens to our podcast, I feel for you, bro. You know the ones there. <laughs> You're Sorry just... to hear that. Sorry <laughs> to hear that about what your brother. But yeah, man. like you're just out here, like thinking, what's going on? I, I want to see the fully geek pod. I can't hear. Everyone's trying to pull their thing. The internet, the Wi-Fi is down. Yeah, it's a lot. I, know. I feel I feel safe for them, you know. But it's 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 one of those ones. I suppose it's like yeah, you've got to set some example, isn't it? Because even like, not... it, like, sorry, man. Hmm. Um, even like um, today, I, what they'll say that how like people in those countries, obviously. They don't have no work to do at the moment, in it basically. So it's like they either so they're trying to find them other jobs to do mm. within the company, or it's got to be see you later. Mm. Yeah. So, well, well, to be fair, people are not getting paid. It's not Swift. It's not there's there's no Swift. So if there's no Swift, people are not going to get paid anyway. Yeah. No, but that, that's what I'm saying. That's why I think it's a little bit like for just, just I'm not talking about um, for the main man because they're always going to be hooked up, but for the common man, that's a lot though. Oh yeah, yeah, no, it's a lot, it's a lot, bro. We thought it was bad when we thought we there was COVID and people was trying to like stockpile like toilet roll and all them kind of stuff. Ima- imagine you didn't get paid until next week or whatever, and the banks them stopped. What can you yeah. do with yourself? Come on, man. Yeah, but it is what it is. 
I th- what do you think? Roman Abramovich finally selling Chelsea. So, because <sighs> I know last time we spoke about it, he said that he was just it was just gonna he was gonna temporarily or give it to the, the people to hold for him, but now he's gonna sell it. Yeah, I, I, I really don't understand what's going on there. The only reason why I say that is because it's enough shares have been his help is is all accounting and everything that belongs to Everton has been stopped. So mm. w- w- why haven't they stopped anything in regards to Abramovich? No, but I don't know. I don't know if they if he's they're they're trying to sanction him yet. But well, he should be the, one of the first people to be sanctioned. Well, not why, why, why of, first? No, because he has he has he was he was classed as Putin's one of his, one of his very 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 close friends, very close associates. And they they sanctioned Usunov first, and they haven't even sanctioned um, Ib, um, Ib, called it Ibrahimovic, Abramovich. Mm. I'm, I'm, just, I'm, just, I'm just shocked by that. Yeah, and especially, so he, but the man's not allowed. Okay, he wasn't allowed in the country before this. Yeah, he's definitely no, yeah, can't be, because yeah. he had he had li- he had well he had links anyway in general. But there is the, yeah exactly. So I don't understand why it's taking so long to sanction him. Yeah, I don't know. But, I just, I just, I just yeah. feel like you know sometimes. You know, if you're in the scene, say, all right, you, for example, Rich, you used to be like uh, like with the Beats and the MCs and all them kind of stuff. Like, So you know, you have associates, innit? So yeah. like you might par with them. They're not really your boys, but do you get me? Whenever you're out, it's all love and that, yeah? Mm. Like imagine them sanctioning you because you are a associate of a next man. That's a bit out of order. Oh, yeah. No, of course it is. Of course it is. And, and they, want, they want everyone to feel the pain in Russia. Yeah, you, know, like, you, you, you might not be physically people being killed, in, in Russia, but they want to make you feel it as much as possible, so that you can you can you can suffer as as. Well, what's suffer. the options, Nate? Though, what's the options? What can they do? I, I don't know what they can do. I just I, like who? I, Who's that? Like, For me, I'm saying, no, I'm just saying against Russia. What? Can, okay, you're saying like obviously, people, like we just said, the the, the the innocent brother in Russia is suffering right now because certain things have been taken away from him, isn't it? Hmm. Do you know what I mean? And he's got nothing to do with it, but. What what uh, what can what else can the world do? To, you know what I mean to bring this, uh, like you know what I mean to let Russia know what you're doing is efforts. You know what I mean. I think they yeah. know that, but I feel like the, I just I don't think this is. I just don't know if this is going to help. They might have got money like in Russia, like the war, the generals. They've got money in it, like. But I just think in general, like, I don't know what you could do. But the common man, I feel for him right now. Oh yeah, the, the, the government. It, like you, NATO, it's NATO itself can't do nothing apart from um, if they cross the, the line, they go to war, and that's yeah, that's what they're they trying to the, avoid. Russia's crossed the line, though. No, they haven't crossed the line. They still they still haven't touched NATO land. They haven't hit the oh, red yeah, line. Oh yeah, because Ukraine. Oh yeah, Ukraine's not NATO. It, they're, yeah. they're, they're in talks, isn't it? I think this is what this is the whole thing. Of, yeah, right? it's because Putin they're in talks. They're in talks. And basically, Putin didn't want any of the Americans in that near his land, isn't it? I hear it. But he's still calling it his land. Well, Russia, I hear it. Yeah, no, no, look, look, at the end of the day, there's, there's, there's people, there's people suffering, people, you know, I've lost loved ones and it, 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 it is really bad. Yeah. It is bad, but, you know, it's, um, yeah, it's... That's what happens, isn't it? When, when there's things like this happening, it's like, because the higher ups are beefing with each other, the little guy suffers, man, mm. on both yeah. sides. I mean, they're, they're, they're the ones that really suffer, like... Yeah, so that's, that's what it is. Because the, the, the Cold War never ended, you know. There's no. always been a Cold War between Russia and America. Always. It's never ended. Uh, and um, with, um, with Russia, they, they provide us oil. They provide... Gas. They provide us... Is it gas? Gas and oil, yeah. Gas and oil. And I think, I believe, my understanding is they provide 40%, 40 to 50% of oil to, to um, Europe. What they're going to do, what they plan to do by the end of next year is to reduce that to 5% and source oil elsewhere instead of going through Russia. So they're trying to burn them as much as possible that they can burn them. By next year? That's a joke, bro. The war could be, the war could be mashed up by then. But, yeah, but it, it, it's a case of Russia not doing it ever again. You, you do to, it again. We need to stop using fossil fuels anyway, man. No, no, of course. That's another story. Yeah, start going green. Yeah, yeah. Gang green. Going green. I know, I know. Oh, gangrene. 
All right, cool. I'm glad all of you rolled your eyes at that one, though, still. All right. It was funny. Yeah, no, still, still, still. still. All right, cool. All right, gang, 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 gang. All right, guys, that's, yeah, the worst war still going on. Um, I will say a video was sent to me today. I don't know if it's real, but if it is real, it's very, very deep. And that was of um, a news reporter reporting the Russian war. And in behind him, he started talking about all of the dead bodies and all of the dead bodies that was in, um, they were all in body bags. But then there was one at the front, the, per- the body bag was moving and the person hadn't put the body bag on top of them properly. And then another reporter had run across to try and fix it. It was in the boilers yeah. of the budget. Um, clearly, uh, none of you No, no, I've seen it. Yeah. Uh, shout, no, out Marlon, shout out Marlon for oh, seeing it. Shout out Marlon. I will watch it, I promise. I promise I'll watch it. I'll comment back as well. I, I did. Shout out, Marlon. All right. <laughs> cool. Today, guys, is the 8th of March. Okay. It's officially International Women's Day. Um, and I would just like to shout out and say to all of our female listeners, happy Inter- International Women's Day. Um, so, but today, I think the theme for this year is gender equality. So, yeah, shout you all out. Um, hope you all had a lovely day. Um, I know Mother's Day is also coming up soon. But, um, yeah, just wanted to say happy Thank International you. Women's Day. Um, I think it's the 27th of March. Yeah, right? Thank you, thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. don't worry, don't, don't worry. We'll, 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 we'll hold on that before. Yeah, they, we ain't going to let Kel try and do that one until we're just here. So what did you lot do for Mother's Day this year? You lot are so bad. You see how I looked after you, Mum? Okay, it's not one of those ones this year, all right? <laughs> okay, did any of you lot uh, wish um, women in International Women's Day today? Nah. Okay, cool. Yeah, of course, yeah, I, I mean, I of course I did. I did. Sorry, I mean, I did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I did. No, I did we celebrate at school? Um, I've done assemblies for tomorrow, um, so hopefully they will do it for tomorrow, yeah, because uh, my year 11's assembly is on a Wednesday. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. all right. I'll pick up women, honestly, it's a big up women, man. They, mm-hmm. they, they do a lot, Listen, man. man like, they do a lot, bro, honestly. Yeah, up, man. like I said, without them, we're rich. Be here. No, I'm joking, let's not go too rich. All right, let's just move on. <laughs> all right, um. <laughs> this week we all this weekend we also celebrated Ghana's 65th independence. Bluku, bluku. Ooh, um, yeah. Did any of you go and eat some jollof and stew? Oh, which let's let's shame Merv. Let's show let's show what independence <laughs> really right. means. Let's Can't shame Merv in it. Listen, there's a two against one in there. So come on, come on, Rich. Speak your gun. Speak your gun. Uh, uh, show them the gun. I got, I got stick. I got Sit stick there. in it. I got stick Get last them. week from a lot of people. So no my stuff in it. <laughs> Just saying, innit? That was well, awful. That was awful, yeah, man. Yeah. <laughs> I'll sit back. It's your turn now, innit? <laughs> Come. So, what? So, talk to us. What's Ghana independence? Talk to me. What's what? what are you well, first of all, no, first of all, we were the first Af- African nation to gain independence. You know what I mean? So, that's a big up. We, 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 we set the trends and others follow. Yeah, yeah. But another shout out to Haiti, though, who are the original bad boys. You know what I mean? They're the first yeah, black nation. True. So, shout out to Haiti. But um, yeah, man, no, it's just it's 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 an honor. Sixty five years old, you know. What I mean, it's 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 big. Do you, you know, do you know what I question? Should we still be celebrating this? Yeah, man, it was an achievement, bro. It was an achievement. Kwame and Kuma, like he, he. Yeah, I know, I know, I know, you know I know. I mean? I know. Why, why do you it, think it was unheard of at the time? Why Why do you ask that, Rich? No, it's it's just like, you know. Okay, cool. We we've pulled away. Uh, we're, we're no longer colonized, which is which is a great achievement. But I just I just think should we should we continue to celebrate a, an occasion in that sense? I, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just I, I just I don't know. I just for the next several hundred years at least. Yeah, man, got to do it, man. Until you're yeah. like Barbados, but like, then you got to celebrate, innit? What do you mean? Do you mean like, yeah. What do you mean? Like ain't ain't when at Barbados where the Queen's not head of state and all that stuff no more is that is that what you lot have done? No, we we were done a long time no. ago. Bro. Oh, you lot yeah. proper like independent. Yeah, like, yeah. You, since, yeah. Since, since 1960 we've been okay. Okay, so we got our independence 1957 and we became a republic in 1960. Okay, well this is what I'm saying. Talk the thing. You lot are talking about saying, should we celebrate? It? Come, talk uh, the facts. Him, I want, me, I want him, people, me. I want people to be saying, "Nah, them man really rep Ghana, bro." That's what I want to hear. What? No, but I'm on, no, but I'm just I'm asking the question. I'm thinking, should we still celebrate? Uh, but but Merv is saying you should still celebrate until seven hundred years. But I'm just Se- like several, several, oh, several. <laughs> so, so several, so several. At least, years, at least, did it? Yeah. Yeah. I, I I don't know. I just I don't know. I don't know. 
Anyway, I, Rich, I, I, before you go down on this, no, yeah. no, there's a lot, there's Happy a lot of people the pre- There's a lot of people I speak to and who say that I don't really, don't really celebrate it no more. But you know, people went through a lot of stuff to get to for us to be independent. Anyway, well, this, this is exactly it. Rich. This is it, man. Exactly it has rich. to be a constant reminder. Constant reminder. So that's right, why we have to celebrate. Go on, say something, God, for the people, then, Rich. Chale, come on, Chale, come on. I don't speak girl. Yeah, lies. I don't speak lies. girl. My mum speaks girl. Well, well, Kel, why don't you do it? Kel, obviously you know, Kel, isn't it? Nah, That's I your speak... turn, go, Kel. No, go, I thought, go. Cause, no, cause I, I've heard you speak girl before, so I thought it was girl, isn't it? I you must know one girl. or two words, man, or a phrase, at least. Yeah, I'll say, okay, in our language, leke, me a fodoma. You probably had that prepared. Like... Which, which means? I mean, like, he's like, how, how are you guys? And then okay. if you translate the second part, literally it means, are you awake? But it's, it's like, are you guys all right? Okay. Um, yeah. yeah Big now. man, bad man, bad man. Yeah. All right, cool. So on the, if we was in Ghana, what would we eat in? Well, banku, well, okra soup. No, no but then again, but, but you say that, because yesterday it was Ghana Independence, it was a Sunday. So Sunday is standard fufu day. I didn't know I- that. Uh, Sunday, in, in no, Gali, Sunday, in, yesterday was Monday actually. Oh, I know it was celebrated on Sunday, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah so standard okay. Sunday, Sunday standard fufu anyway. Oh, did, you, did, you, did you have that? But, but fufu is no, not, no, I didn't have it. It's not, that's not a standard in every household. You get me? What on a, what, on a Sunday? Not in every household, no. Boy, I don't know, but because certain yeah. house like, like, what well, fufu, yeah, we ate fufu, but it wasn't like a, a Sunday thing. Like, we, we, we're more of the banku side of things. You get me, the banku and the you know, I was seen. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. What's banku? Banku is like a, uh, it's like a, a doughy kind of. Um, I can't remember, can't remember what it's made it's out. Like, of. It's like fufu, but it's harder, and it's yeah. it's, it's a bit more. Um, it's got like a twang to it. See how fufu yeah, just tastes kind of sweet, kind of not sweet, but it's got like a, a it's a sweet kind of taste. But banku is more of a, like a fermented kind of taste. Okay. What's it made of? I can't remember what it's made like, out of. It's made of um, corn, maize. I think, yeah, maize. Is it? Yeah. All right. What's a Ghanaian drink? Come educate the people. You got, you got, you got palm wine. You got a petashi. Don't touch uh, those drinks there, you know. Don't yo, touch uh, those I mean, like, drinks I had, there. Like I said, there was people in the comments last week talking about they didn't really eat, they didn't really mess with African food, but when they spoke, they heard Rich and them describe some of the jollof and stuff, they, they wanted ins. They saw yeah, the picture, man. they wanted in. That's what I'm trying to get me. We're, trying, we're international now. Bro, that's, that's what I'm saying, bro. Like, Look, you know? I, I, would, I would advise anyone, do not drink apatashi. Do not do it to yourself. Do not ruin your system. It's a, it's a strong spirit, in it? Very strong okay. spirit. Uh, it's it's, it's but, like diesel, bro. Yeah, but we've got, we've, got palm, we've got palm wine. Palm wine is like, it's, it's a quiet taste, though. Not everyone can like it. But I like it. It's like, it's huh? like a, palm wine. I love palm wine. I love it, man. Um, you don't mind, then. I, 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 well, like some malt, some malt drink. Super well, like malt. Yeah, like yeah. like a super malt type drink. Do you like have like? Oh, yeah, super well, super malt is this, it's an international that's, drink, that's, isn't that's, it? That's, that's a standard. That's a standard kind of drink anyway. But um, yeah, palm wine is not a malt drink. It's like some next kind of drink. But you drink it with like I don't know. It's, it's appetizer kind of drink. But yeah, man, it's big things, big things. But yeah, man. All right, cool. You know what it is. You know, you know, you know. It's, let me say. Look, you know what it is. Yeah. Like there's so many different cultures in Ghana, so many different uh, ethnic groups, and do you know what I mean? So every everyone, every every part of Ghana is different. The same way, like it goes, oh, fufu Sunday is a Sunday meal. Not in my household, you know, not in our culture, but in his culture, maybe it is. Do you know what I mean? Because he he's mm. a, you know what I mean. They speak tree and stuff. So yeah, so like, if it's just different. So it's it's it's, it's, it's you can't specifically say yeah, everyone eats this, everyone eats that. It's just different cultures coming together mm. in it. Okay. So you know, Kel, Kel side is the Irish side of in Ghana. <laughs> Shut up. Man. Oh, well, it, was the, it was the Irish settlers that came over. Yeah, nah, that's, that's his look. <laughs> Fair enough, man. Like, so, oh, so you not celebrate St. Patrick's Day and that? Oh, don't listen to <laughs> don't listen to Rich. Rich is so much man. Do, man. Oh, fair enough. Sorry, my bad. All right, cool. Um, all right, cool. Just. No, I never we're not talking about intelligence today. We've gone past that now. But um guys, 
this week. We spoke about it a little while ago when it first came out, the story first broke out about um, Mr. Dizzy Rascal. Um, but Mr. Dizzy Rascal has now been, um, what's the word? Found guilty. Um, and he came out of court, saw a brother who was like a news reporter, picked up his camera and dashed it across the, way, the road. He didn't pick it up. He knocked it out of his hand. He knocked it out of his hand and dashed it across the road. <laughs> and, 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 and I swear he dropped, then he picked it up and dashed yeah, it. Yeah, Sorry, that's what it was. He dropped, picked yeah, up, man. then dashed it. I was thinking, right, you got to lick someone's head with that, bro. I, did, I don't have no idea what's going on. I'm sorry. You know, you yeah, talk. One second, just mute. One second. Yeah. Do you know what? With the Dizzy situation, I'm surprised it already hasn't been cancelled. Yeah. Because that, that, yeah, I was thinking that, uh, that there's not there's no outrage. Yeah, exactly, I, I, and that's why I'm confused about. Not saying I want him to get cancelled, but because we knew about the situation a couple of months ago, whatever, it, whenever it was, I'm surprised he wasn't cancelled because it was. It was for assaulting um, his child's his child's mother. So I was just like, no, okay. I didn't, know, I didn't know how this is a kid, you know. I had no idea. Yeah, 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 yeah. You, I'm, I, I, so go on. Do you think it's maybe because of his, his, his stat, status? Status? No, nah, nah, that, that status doesn't mean anything to anyone anymore, boy. People look are just... Look, get... all look at all these footballers. You know what I mean? I know, but um, I don't know. I, I, to me, he seems quite well... Known now, I don't oh, know. Yeah, no, he's what? No, yeah. come on, Dizzy, come on. This is a household name. Not, not to say that like he still can't be accountable or anything, but it just seems like when the higher you are, the um, it's probably the longer it takes, unless there's a hard evidence in it. So obviously, they had to kind of prove things before they, before he's cancelled, didn't it? I suppose. Yeah, but, 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 when, but when you be found guilty, you be found guilty, bro. Yeah, no, I mean, but he wasn't found guilty back then, was he? No, no, no. no. Yeah, but what I'm trying to say is now there's no outrage. Now that he's been found guilty, no one's really. I see. I've still. I think I see. I saw on one page. They put it up. Mm. But yeah, it was just like maybe there's, maybe, maybe there's just other sort of pressing things in the news, isn't it? Really, it's like just kind yeah, of no, true. yeah. No, no, look, I, I'm I'm happy he hasn't he hasn't been cancelled. You know, it's not obviously what what he's been accused of doing is not good. Obviously, it's um, you're hitting someone. Mm. Um, but I'm just yeah. yeah. Uh, and I think his reaction after that, it just, it, it, of all things, you why would you want to go and do that? Yeah. I, I just, I don't get it. It's just like, okay, maybe people might say, you know, people have a perception of, okay, it's not saying it's always the case, but um, a man's buttons are pressed when a woman obviously frustrates him and, and when it got to do with children. So you, you might assume maybe it's a one-off occasion. Some people might see that, but him coming out of court and getting a cameraman's camera and he's dashing across the street, it's like, mate, you deserve to be cancelled. And, and you're not helping yourself by doing that. Mm. Yeah, you, know, you, what I'm angry, you know what I mean? Mm. But you know, I was gonna say the, the missus, well, so ex missus released a statement saying that this this is to show that status and wealth doesn't shouldn't protect mm. shouldn't protect you shouldn't protect those that have status and wealth, basically. Yeah, saying that you know, because because what she's trying to put out there is that obviously um, there's a lot of famous people that. Do this kind of stuff, but because they're famous, you yeah, get stuck yeah, on yeah. the carpet, or the or the girlfriend's too shook to say anything. Do you yeah, know what I mean? yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, I need to take accountability. Yeah, no, definitely. Yeah. But yeah, um, apologies about that. Um, people came to knock my door. I had to go and open the door. Mm. My dad. Um, all right, you know what? Let me just. I, I just. I forget. I just told the whole, the whole nation the story. Yeah. So basically, what happened was, yeah, my dad got a parking ticket. Yeah. Yeah. And it said he was driving his car. No, he had left. He didn't pay for parking in, say, I don't know, like some far off, far up place, yeah, like Essex, but like further out than Essex, yeah. So I'm like, Dad, did you drive the car there? He's like, No, I was at work. So I said, So why are you worried about paying the ticket then? Like, so then I've looked online, I've seen the pictures. So as I'm looking at the car, I'm like, Hold on, but this BMW's got a sunroof. My dad's BMW don't have no sunroof. Yeah, I've looked, I was like, my dad's wing mirror thing, like the covers come off, like where someone's knocked it off and he ain't repaired it, but this one's got a, do you get me? So I'm like, dad, you got to sort it out. My dad's just, oh, in the the car, basically someone just cloned the number plate in it. Mm. So I went to do the appeal today and they're like, oh, we only accept the appeal if you've gone to the police to go report it and got a crime reference number and all that stuff in it. So 
I told my dad to take it to the police station, but they've asked him to email the pictures. So I did the pictures for him. So I've sent them to him pictures. I'm like, just email it to him. My dad's like, you're at the police station. Why don't you just email it to them in front of you? That's what we have smartphones for. I don't know how to do all of that. What is the point of you having the latest phones and the latest everything if you can't do Come, simple stuff like you, emails? You know this. This is oldest. Like, like, no, but go back to having brick phones then. Why have you got to have smartphones if you don't they, know how to use it? It's just said they've got it. It's just they've got it. That's right. it. No, Stop trying to play with it. Keep up with the Joneses, man. This is why you're there. You're the son. Exactly. That's what you do. Exactly. That's, that's your job, honestly. <laughs> You don't think it burns me when I see my parents and they're asking me about a million things about the phone. No, no, I hear like, you, but you know what like I'm saying to him, Dad, I'm doing the podcast. Yeah, yeah, can't you just quickly do this? Dad? You need to email the person before it finishes. Dad, I'm doing the podcast. Anyway, it is what it is. We move. All right. <laughs> um, and my kids know that in 30, 40 years' time, this is going to be me. <laughs> yeah, just bugging you. Talking about why and the Xbox One working. All right. Working, no, because I still we're going to be playing. I'm going to play new ones. Um, we also had a very, very sad death this past week. Um, Australian cricketer Shane Warne passed away last week. I think it was. Yeah. End of last week in Thailand. Yeah. 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 Fourth of March. Yeah. I'm not, a big, I'm not a big cricket fan, but I know who he is. It's so weird. Yeah, he's on it. He's exact, right. same thing I was going to say. In fact, as soon as I saw the name, I didn't even see the face yet. I, just, yeah. I know who that man is. Yeah, you know what I mean? It's really. like, I thought, yeah. nah, it's deep, man. Because it's been around since like, it was kids, obviously. Young. Yeah, and, since we're young, man. Yeah. yeah. Like, so that was quite a shock, man. And it's, yeah, young as well, isn't it? Yeah, 52. 50, 52, yeah. 52, man. Suspected heart attack. And he was a leg spin bowler. And yeah, I know him through cricket and stuff like that. I remember, yeah. So it was quite. It was quite bad that he went, like, mm. quite sad. And I think he even tweeted that same, earlier that day, about a cricket, another cricket that had passed away. Yeah, mm. Rodney Marsh. Yeah, and, like, within 24 hours. Yeah, man. It's crazy. Yeah, so um, I do believe he was living his best life in Thailand before he passed, but obviously still yeah. sad. Still sad. Rest in peace, man. Rest in peace, Shane Warren, man. All right, guys, anything else from going on? No, you know, no. Okay, excellent. Cool. Thank you very much, Wes. All right, so let's kick it off with some film, TV, and film. Merv and the logo thing here. So we love it. It's a two minute. I know you said two minute. I heard that. I did. I did. I did. But I just wanted Merv to enter the thing there. TV and film. TV and film. All right, cool. Let's start with Power Book Four. All right. So Sunday was the latest episode of Power Book 4, Force. Um, it was episode five, I believe. Yeah. Um, thoughts on the episode? Kel, were you still watching it? Yeah, I'm still watching it. Yeah, but you know, Power, I let you guys talk. I mean, for me, every episode, looks, it's, it feels the same to me. Honestly, it does, it does, you know, it does come Yeah, to it feels the same to me every episode. Man. That's why I, 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 I don't want to talk about it because, you know I me, mean? I'm missing negative in there, so... <laughs> Nah. Rich, Mav? I thought oh, Mav was no. just going to go. Obviously, um, yeah, no, Tommy to obviously like cried out Claudia's product, innit? And like he was just gassed by it. Like he's just like, um, and, and great exchange of doing that by kissing. Yeah. But anyway, like, um, yeah, he was just, when he got back home in Indiana about it, like, product is, it, it, it almost like, it's almost like it just gives you all the positives. And none of the negatives in it. So I think like they're in that situation now where he wants to work with um like Claudia to sort of distribute their on it. Mm. That was like kind of the gist of the episode. And also <laughs> Lana got kidnapped as well. Yeah, yeah. She she got kidnapped and then Tommy um, rounded up Diamond and the Flynn son to take out the set. Well. Yeah, serves, isn't it? They take yeah, out the Serbs yeah, one by yeah, one. Yeah. Yeah. Because you know the Serbs were rolling packs of six and they were going all, all to the six well different locations where the Serbs at were and taking them out. They were, they were trying to get revenge for um what's the other ones? What's the woman that he killed in the previous episode called again? Oh, I well, name. well we know we know what you're talking about. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So this is in revenge for her really. Yeah, so Markovic was trying to kill Tommy. Basically, Markovic was yeah. Tommy dead. Yeah. But it was a bit one because Lily, she only on her, she went out 
after taking the drug. If she had just done exactly. what she was supposed to, exactly. stayed in her house, she yeah. would have been all right. They would have took out all of the Serbs and everyone would have been fine. Yeah. Mm. True. Yeah. More of the story, did, but, sit down. Yeah, but did they show her even being kidnapped? No, remember, she was uh, high on the drugs and she, she left the house. It. Yeah, but did it didn't show up. But she no, didn't no, stay no. as had it. No. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. But I guess they wouldn't have had the opportunity if she just sat down, her, sat on her ass. No. Yeah, yeah. I agree. I agree. And then you've got obviously you had the whole issue with um, the girl that Tommy was sleeping with. Yeah. Well, well to sort of bribe her in it or black or friends or something. Yeah, he's black so, man. Yeah. He doesn't want her to be with the son. Yeah. Like, never be a part of the family and all that. Yeah. If people if people are not saying because she's black, but it just is giving all that is saying it so many different ways of saying it, but not saying it. Yeah, yeah. But good. she said she said it. We we know because she's she she said it already. That yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? You, you can, I can't be your wife because I'm black. You know what I mean? Because your your dad was really racist, isn't it? Like, like oh yeah, he's old, he's old school. He's, he's old school racist yeah. as well. So and I mean, Diamond brought on his brother. He brought Janard on in on the move with all the serves and that. And then the brother obviously came on, and then his right hand lieutenant Jeremiah Jeremiah yeah. passed away, like got shot. But then I got a bit confused at the end. So you know when um, Tommy goes to go and collect Liliana, or goes to get Liliana yeah. rescue, yeah. and yeah. then there's the person that comes by on the drive by, starts shooting and that, yeah. Uh-huh. Mm. And then obviously Tommy takes Liliana. The Serbs go off, and then we realize that the the drive by was Janard. What was yeah. he trying to do? Like who no, was like he, he wanted to save Liana. He, oh, because started. you thought he slept. You thought you think he went to just save Liliana, and that's why he was there. I think that's why there he helped in that sense. That's why I believe. Like, did he help and Tommy, or did he just? I don't. It was a bit. No, I, yeah, I, no yeah, it helped Tommy because obviously Tommy would have saved Liliana and got away. Why was, did they do it so like sneaky out at the end? Of, like it, it seemed like there was something sinister about his. Motive, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So yeah got some different motive. Because, because at the end, he took his mask off and burnt the van. Yeah, like, I, I, yeah, I that was really, which, I, Yeah, to the point I, I had to it, rewind it again. I'm like, what's that about? I mean, yeah, it, it just it, it wasn't it wasn't clear exactly what was going on there. Hmm. And I don't know, I don't know why Tommy, like, even though she got shot, it went the bullet went straight through. He goes to her, let's go upstairs, and I'm thinking, hold on. This person knows where you live, and you're still going up, going upstairs into your house. But it was like it was literally outside the house as well. Yeah, why are you going upstairs? I, I, I'm trust me, I wouldn't these, be going these upstairs. Are, these are parts of power that annoys me. These little yeah, things. I know, I know. It didn't make sense. It just didn't make sense. And so Claudia's a killer now. Yeah, I was about to say, she's killed her. Like, I understand. Like she's a killer now. Trust me. Poke the girl stabbed, back of her neck. That made her back where. Was it in it? Was it in it? Yeah. Or oh, the back of her know. neck. Back of her neck. Yeah. yeah she she's seen so many films in it where you stab someone in the back of the neck. No, no. Claudia sh- stole the drugs. She she got the drugs stolen from me. Then she wants to start acting up like, mate, why are you talking about? You got the drugs. Duh, 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 duh. Yeah. Then she just stabbed her because she was like, oh, I chose the wrong Flynn. Yeah. Yes. To take up it, take up the dead weight in it. Sweet thing. Fair, no pun intended. T- Tommy and Claudia, or nah? No, no, no. That's not. That's not going to happen. That's just for that's for business transactions needs only. I, I, I think if anything, Liliana, and Tommy, and no, they're going to have a love triangle. I reckon. A love you say triangle. what? Love triangle, isn't it? Obviously, it's love child. I thought, huh? Oh, love triangle. <laughs> oh no, man! I'm saying I'm seeing some like I'm seeing some vibes there between Tommy and Liliana as well. I don't know though, man. I don't think that's Tommy's. I don't think that's Tommy's flavor. No, but and Tommy says it's not his flavor. But but it's that's, one... that's what we're led to believe, isn't it? But like, look at look at their history. Like, obviously, he went he went to kill her and everything like that, and now he's just like literally saving her. So I, I reckon they're gonna have. To, well, uh, could be wrong, but that's... that's the thing. Why should Tommy care about her so much like that? You just you just got re- reacquainted with her. For a few days, yeah, she helped you a little bit, but the old Tommy, the old Tommy, be like, kill him, man, I don't care. No, yeah, but do you know what? The old Tommy, it's a new Tommy, it's, 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 it's yeah, a, it's a new it's Tommy, man. City. It's a different it's Tommy, city. It? It's his show, so he's got a, got a set. Some he, need, he needs the backers. He needs the backers. Yeah. And what was going on with Tommy and the brother? Like, I was, I was. No, no, I, didn't, I didn't get that. I didn't get that part. 
that scene was just chucked in for no reason. It just didn't make sense. Well, the picture yeah. scene, yeah. 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 He's watching the video and he sees Tommy there. Like, I don't I don't get what you I don't get it. No, so it just it just proves that Tommy and him were around each other when they were growing up. Oh because because there's a picture where I think he's holding an ice cream at that time. The brother's holding an ice cream, and in the background, this is Tommy walking past yeah. behind a fence. So I, I'm just so this just proves they were around together at the same time. Who, who's supposed sort. to be the eldest? I don't know. You know. <sighs> no, they both look. They both look around the same age. Yeah, yeah, yeah because yeah, it's because yeah. it's the same mum. Like oh, yeah, yeah, can't yeah, be the yeah, same yeah. age. Yeah. Like that's my that's my thing. Like if they were that, if it was the dad, like, the dad twins. could do whatever he wants in it. Yeah. Like could be out there just like whatever. Yeah. Shooting out the place. But there's a mum. There has to be at least. It's true, you know. Like a year's grace. If they're twins, yeah, I'm out. I'm out. No, they're yeah. definitely not twins. They're 100 <laughs> percent not twins. Bro. If they're I'll, twins, I'll I'll make no, they got different dads. I'll, Remember, Tommy I'll killed make his dads. Tommy killed his dad, and my yeah. man's dad's still there. And not even that, Nate. Once oh, yeah. the man's right. The yeah, I know. That's why I said well, can't. I'll, 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 I'll it, it can happen. It can happen. It can happen. All right. Genetically, it can happen, but in this look program, at, it's not going to happen. Lorenzo and Ken. Ken. <laughs> Again, this year. It's, it's, <laughs> all right. It's poorly. Act. All right. So. Hopefully, we've got. I don't know how many left episodes we've got left of this series. No, I don't know. We've if got it's a break. We're on a mid-season break at the moment. What? Wait, don't don't yeah. say that. I think it is a break. No, it it's a break. Don't, don't say that. That was no cliffhanger. Too. Oh, there, there, there's me. no break, man. How is there a break, bro? They, they, the trailer for next week's episode's come out already, man. For sure. Yeah, bro. Oh, well, I think it. Yeah. No, don't don't tell me this, guys. No, it is, it is back. It is back. It is back. And it's a yeah. Back. Yeah, bro. It's eight episodes. It's got the 6th of March, the 13th. Yeah. The 20th, the 27th. The 6th of March is already gone. Yeah. So you've got the 13th, the 20th, the 27th. So it's three more episodes, I believe. Mm-hmm. Usually, this is the time where it starts to kick up. So hopefully it starts to get a bit juicy now. Pause. Yeah, it's 10, 10 episodes. Yeah, 10. Is it 10 or 8? Yeah, 10. Okay. Going up to April then? Yeah. So we're half. Okay. Yeah. Do you know what I've just so I've just randomly gone into um gone into it on the cast of um of the force and I just see who's back in there. What's that Michael J. Ferguson? Oh I mean, spoilers, just, why don't you? Huh? Spoilers, why don't you? No, I've just looked I just looked at it. Anyone could have seen that, everyone could have Tubi. googled it and looked at the cut too, but yeah, he comes back in it. See. Hey, you heard it here exclusive. Too bit. Rich. <laughs> I did like him. I did like him as well. I liked him. Pause. He licks his lips as always. So I did I know, like no, him. No, 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 <laughs> no. Nah, you know what it is? I ain't gonna lie. People, some people have messaged me and go, "You man are slipping on the pause thing." You know, like some of you are saying some suspect things. <laughs> Just putting that. So, there, so, so it's only suspect if your mind is suspect. You hear that, Sean? Rich is calling you suspect. <laughs> he just outed him. Right? No, yeah, no, he just outed him. Right? <laughs> <laughs> some, some people just became Sean. <laughs> <laughs> No, that's the alias. That's the alias. All right, cool. Well, let's get back to Power Book 4 next week and we see what's going on. We've got another four weeks of that. Five, four weeks. All right, five episodes, sorry. So, this week we also had Bel Air. All right, season one, episode six. Where do we start with this this, this episode? So, obviously, like, we're all getting trolled on social media, isn't it, basically? Because of... Yeah, because it's... Just, yeah. Like I love what's his name, Trey. You think yeah, Trey yeah, just started yeah. all of that basically, isn't it? Yeah. So he's just getting trolled and just be just in his feelings and it just like moping around and stuff. He's a good will, you know. He's no, he is will. definitely, yeah. Definitely a good will. Oh, yeah. Right. Like, um but I suppose he just he, he kind of just starts to come around when obviously like because they're having a function for Lisa's mum, isn't it? Like yeah. um, sort of anniversary function. Obviously, when he sees Lisa's oh, Lisa, upset. Yeah, Lisa's dad was playing away, but wow. Yeah. Alive or ill. Yeah, yeah. so when, when oh, we've yeah. done the match, she's like, wait a minute. He died this. She was sitting there, like, yeah. She's so... no, do you see that? See that? Yeah. That, you know, like the cringiness inside me was like, no, shut up, shut up. Bro, um, yeah, she's no, he deep. said she was it's a holiday. Deep. But hold on, you went on holiday. I was like, nah. Oh. Yeah, she was just talking too much, man. Like, too shut much. up, man. 
you know, she, she should have just took the advice and just like, not, don't say anything, not your function. But she I want to sh- speak. I want to say something. Said um, too much. Yeah. She, yeah, she's in her. She's in her. I hate, I hate people like that. I hate people like that. Passion. <laughs> you hate people? No way. Shut up. Get out of here. <laughs> Get out of here. Stop just just a little bit. I, just, just a little bit. So we had, um, obviously, Uncle Phil talked him around. Will then came about. Um, the food wasn't going to go to plan. So they had to get Big Sister to come and help. And she was getting mad pressure from the house, telling that if you don't post within 24 hours, you start to lose followers and all of this type of things. She posted it, right? Yeah, but that was right at the end. And even then, why was it a great post? What do you mean? Because she was wearing hardly anything. Very nice. Okay. Okay. It's very international women's day today. You're not going to have to do that. All right, cool. She was doing what she was doing. All right. She helped out. Um, also, we had Ashley. Ashley wanted to tell her little friend that she had a crush on her, but the friend had a crush on Will. So oh, she... do you remember that old? Do you remember the yeah, old yeah, one? Yeah. Like, oh, that, was that, the swim, that was the one in the swimsuit, isn't it? Yeah, she's a love Will, follow <laughs> everywhere. And Carl was like, I've got muscles. <laughs> <laughs> that was the one where they, they, they all three of them had a different story. Yeah. Like they all, the same event, but they all had a different story yeah. about Uncle Phil and the rubber ring. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. He's so dreamy. <laughs> yeah, he's so dreamy. Yeah. <laughs> oh, sorry, on a random one. Shout out DJ Ace. Um, don't know if any of you ever watch Master. Do any of you watch Mastermind still? No. Nah. Master what? Mastermind. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, 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 oh. So basically, uh, Ace was on Mastermind this week, and his chosen topic was Fresh Prince of Bel Air. Oh, is it? Jeez. He got every episode, he got every question right. Come on. Got every question oh, right. Then, then he fucked up on the general knowledge and didn't win. But like on that fresh on the fresh prince, he was there, bro. He was there. It was it was, big, it was quite big. sick. It was quite sick. Um, sorry, we go back. Aunt Viv with the art thing. Oh yeah, no. Nah. What's my man's intentions? Oh, he, wants beat, he wants to beat, bro. He wants to beat, bro. Do you know what is, I really hope Aunt Viv doesn't do it, though. I hope so, man. Not even a, I don't want like, a kiss or nothing. Yeah, I don't want nothing. Oh, man. Especially after, like, what's happening, we're like, she's just outraged about um, Lisa's dad, didn't it? And, and partner as well. So, it, cool. No, no, no. Do you know what is? This is a new Belair, so anything that stuff that can happen right now, um, I, and, I, and, it, and it's and it's and, it, and it's kind of the realness of it. It can happen, but I, I wouldn't want it to happen. I think it would ruin. Oh, and I, I, I don't think I don't think it will happen. I think she'll, she will accidentally get herself in a situation. Yeah, they like like even what happened with the other aunt with the um, uh, reverend guy, like the um, Richard yeah. Roundtree guy. Isn't it? Like, so yeah. It, it, yeah. It, might, it might be that, or who knows? Just to make it different, they might go the whole way. You never know. Oh, no, I want to, I want him to shut it down, brother. I want him to shut it down. Carlton. Do you know what? I, I, I feel this episode, you will see a normal car. I mean, going forward, you will see the Carlton and Will relationship completely change from what, we, what we've seen in the last few episodes. I, I think he covered his back and stuff. Yeah, the, the drug thing and him hugging Carlton because um, he was obviously he was super high, oh. snorting. I think this is where you'll see their relationship in be embedded and they'll be more as brothers what we what we've known to see in Fresh Prince. Did, did you not think that Carlton could see and hear everything from his window? Like absolutely everything. Like every conversation he could hear word for word, yeah. See everything. But right at the end, he went there. I literally thought they were gonna I was like, please don't lips, please don't lips, because Carlton's gonna see. Please don't lips that Carlton's gonna see. Obviously, it did lips, but it was no cotton, so I guess it worked mm-hmm. out in the end. Do you think Will's falling for Lisa a little bit too quickly as well, though? Probably one of them love at first sight, innit, man? You have to keep it, keep it old school, man. No, no, no. We, 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 well, obviously, it's not a Fresh Prince remake, but obviously, that Will, he was doing his thing before he met Lisa. He nah. was out yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Well, that, but, but that's like he was well. It was much, it was much more established, and wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, but we're not getting. We're, I, the thing is, I don't think we're getting the how many episodes this season. Like, you know, I don't know how many there was in the original, and also they probably just might want to sort of 
water down his character a bit because he, when you think about it, it's like someone that kind of character these days is just probably not a good role model mm. for people watching him. Yet. So it was a bit of a dog, isn't it? That's a ball at the time. So he was a dog at that time because don't forget how he met Lisa. Yeah, let's speak, part... let's speak to one who's <laughs> native land. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> When Lisa had, Lisa had to do that thing where they should have yeah, tied him up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. To get into the fraternity group, innit? Yeah, like, dirty yeah. dog. <laughs> All right. Big. I don't even actually know how many episodes are in this series. Anyone know? Let me check. Oh. I would imagine, I, I don't know, I'd say in 10 or 12. But let's just see, shall we? And we're on episode six now, so maybe, okay. I, I still I, I still love Jeffrey now. Hmm. He needs to be in the more Do you know what I mean? It's not about. He, 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 he just comes in. Ten episodes. Ten. Okay. I, I know what you mean. You want to see more, but give, give, give him time. I, don't, I, I think there's much more to come of him, without a doubt. Definitely much more to come of him because them them two are just getting involved. They're involved in a lot of stuff. Him and straight, him and Phil. Straight mafia business. Yeah, definitely. Jeff's definitely not the butler boy. No, 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 no. He's a house manager. He's a fixer. He's a, literally he's a fixer, yeah. isn't it? He's a very dud of him, bro. Yeah, he's a fixer. He's a fixer. Yes. All right. Well, we're still here for Bel Air. All right. Um, next on the agenda is the final episode of Genius, episode three, the Kanye West trilogy. Um, I'll just kick it off and say the first two episodes of Genius were amazing. <laughs> The third episode, I went into smash the TV. <laughs> I, I haven't why? even watched it. I haven't why? watched it. Why? Why did you want to smash the TV? This is the new Kanye, and I don't like the new Kanye. I mean, like, we all saw it coming, man. We saw it coming. But the thing is, you had that hate for him before the, the episode even aired. No, so no, you, I, I had not imagine you watched it. I I that's what I'm saying. I've watched it and, and I've yeah. just been disappointed. Yeah. But you could also see, I think, if after the first three episodes, we stopped it, I think it would have been one of the. It would have been a sick, sick um, documentary, and we left it at that. But you can see that because he wasn't around, my man. Yeah, and that's Judy. why. Yeah, all of this footage isn't the greatest. Do you know what I mean? Like, I felt that you you got something out of the first two episodes. The third episode, like one minute, like we've just done the first album, then like we're seeing at a concert him saying, "Oh, I've got to stop the concert. Something's happened to Kim." Then we're like, it was just, it was rushing through everything, but obviously because my man weren't around. It's a rise and fall story, isn't it? To be fair, when you think about it. Yeah, but in Kanye's mm. eyes, it's the rise and rise. He doesn't mm. see nothing wrong with his behavior. Mm. I liked it, man. I liked it. I liked it. it I was, like, obviously, it was, it was good the first two, but I, I liked it. I enjoyed it. I, I didn't. I, I think, I, I felt for a coup, you know, my man, when Kanye oh, forgot his name. Like, nah, he was messing about. He was just messing about. Nah, nah, he weren't messing about, bro. <laughs> but he was drunk. He was, he was gone. He was nah, gone, he was gone. No, but bro, he pulled it back. But did you, see, you saw it on my man's face, though. If he didn't pull it back, yeah. I don't know what he would have done. I know what he would have done, obviously. But oh, I was kind of like, oh, I don't know. Let's make it. I, was, I felt uncomfortable. I yeah. felt uncomfortable, bro. Do you know what I liked though at the beginning of the um this one where that guy he was talking to like he like, kind of was a vet to him because he's like. You're not a genius, you know. He goes, Jay Z's oh, a genius. Rhyme, rhyme fist, rhyme fist, yeah. Yeah. And he's like, No, I'm mean, like, he goes, oh, How can you tell me I'm not a genius? Like, I thought, it's true, you know, like, imagine that you're, you're, you're just coming, I'm a genius. Like, he ain't under a stripe yet, innit? Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Self proclaimed. And you're right, Kel, I didn't like Kanye before. I, I don't really like Kanye, so maybe I am feeling it very much with biasness. But that whole Sunday sermon, all of that, it's meaty, bro. Uh, hold on. You've just, the last two weeks, you've been praising Kanye. The old Kanye. Fa- yeah, but you know. The old Kanye, Kel knows, bruv. I had every album. On the I, I way get, to uni, every song. Like, you get me? I get like, what you're saying, though. Because, like, when I... I mean, you know, he's Kanye, isn't it? I, I think the first two episodes of him, it's like, yeah, that's the Kanye we knew, isn't it? That we properly appreciated and loved and stuff. But now he's just... Just that guy now, isn't it? Just, just controversial, controversial for controversial. I was like, I'm not interested in that. But seeing these first two ones, you're like, 
why couldn't we still have this Kanye? Do you know what I mean? Or, or just even like, if you're going to change, then change should be better or something. Do you know what I mean? But I get what you're saying. But don't forget, he's got bipolar, right? So it's, it's something that happened gradually throughout his, his, his career. Basically, what it is, is the long and short of it is he felt guilty about what happened to his mum and he's never recovered. Yeah, that too. That's, that's what it is. It's, it's that, but I don't. I don't like that. When Kanye starts talking, and he's like, "Oh no, it's not. It's about. It's an act. It's a performance. You've got to do. Get out of here, man. <clears throat> Get out of here, man. Kel, you're right. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's like Kel, you can do anything. It's alright. It's cool, man. Don't watch that. <laughs> Roy, close on that sofa. <laughs> <laughs> Sleepless nights, man. Catching up. But yeah. <laughs> Kel, it's what you got to sit in a, in a straight back chair, bro. Yeah. <laughs> All right, cool. All right, well, Genius, would you still recommend it as a trilogy to watch for everyone else? Yeah, yeah. 100%. Yeah, yeah, 100%, 100%, 100%. Yeah. yeah. All right, well, if you're a fan and you haven't watched it, go do watch it. It's out on Netflix. I recommend the first two episodes. The rest of them say watch the third one. It's all right. Yeah, man. I think it's, to me, it's all about the hunger that he had, that drive. If you want to be committed to something, you're about, it's about having that drive and that commitment. You you got that, you'll make it. And you can apply that to anything. And believe in your source, man. Believe in your, in your, in your product. Believe in what you put out there. And just keep, yeah, just keep having faith in it. And some someone somewhere will hear it, man, one day. All right. Cool. All right. Um, briefly, as I know, probably Merv is probably the only one that's up to date with this. Um, but Peaky Blinders returned um, for the final season of Peaky Blinders. Um, it's Peaky Blinders season what, Merv? Six. Six. Um, I believe you stopped after, or you, you haven't yet watched five, Vickel, or you watched five? Yeah, yeah, I stopped after season four. I thought that was the perfect ending. So I'm, I'm... <laughs> Mike gave it his own ending, you know. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah. Oh, are, sure, are you no, not I... going to watch five and six? Or you... I, I will, I will. I will, I will. <laughs> no, no, it's going to be three years. <laughs> No, I respect it. If you, bro, that's gangster. Yeah, uh, you know, I, I retired Flash. I retired Flash. No, I'm, see, I'm not. I, but you retired well, Flash. Flash, is, Flash deserves yeah. to be retired. Yeah, that is, deserves to be retired. Peaky Blinders. I would. Do you have stop? Because I just thought the perfect ending, and just leave it. Just leave it alone. And I, and like I said a few weeks ago, it, it took them like two years to make a season five because they then themselves ended it there as well. But they just thought, you know, the the people want it, the fans want it. Let's just give them another one. I was like, nah, man, just this, this is it perfect. I, I was scared to watch season five because I thought it would be shit and it would just, just ruin my whole Peaky Blinders experience in it. But Merv, you're saying it's all right, yeah, season five. Yeah, 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 still got the fives in there. Right. I've, I've just started watching it. So um, season one, episode three, I almost locked it off <laughs> after one episode and I was told no to persevere. Kel, Kel told me get to episode three before it gets better. So I will let you know next week if if, if that is a thing. <laughs> yeah. Um, and probably there's like six weeks, six episodes in each series, isn't it? Yeah. That's yeah. why I'm kind of like I don't mind trying to battle it for it. Yeah. And then hopefully by the final season finale, I'd have been up to date. That's the plan anyway. All right, cool. How's 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 it going so far, man? Yes, yeah, it's, it's fine. Like, yeah, fine. The characters that you enjoy seeing, yeah, it's good. Oh, right, cool. Yeah, I'm. Yeah, no, that's. I, yeah, like, I'll let you know how I feel next week. Mm. Rich, I know you, I don't expect you to watch it, so that's cool. Okay. I plan to. Don't worry, I plan to. <laughs> yeah, whatever, man. whatever. All right. We also had a return last week, and I've got very, very confused by this. Um, the return of Killing Eve. All right, so we're now Killing Eve season four, episode one and two, but it comes out on iPlayer before it comes out on the TV. Yeah, I was, I was so angry yesterday. I was just waiting till like nine o'clock. Yeah. So well, I can't see on the TV guide. No, anyway. and then when on the actual TV guide, it comes out on the Saturday. So Saturday that just went was episode one. So on my series link, it's recorded episode one. But Siri, episode two came out yesterday on iPlayer. So it yeah. comes out on iPlayer on Monday, then it comes out on BBC on the Saturday. And it must come out early, isn't it, or something? 
I don't know because to be honest, I don't know, bro. When I tried to search for it, I couldn't find it, and then I actually yeah. watched it today. Yeah, I watched it about eight o'clock yesterday. Yeah, so it's yeah. a bit of a mad one. So I don't know. They're trying to go through iPlayer first. Hmm. Um, what are your thoughts on Kill? Have you watched? You started Kill? I haven't. You know, I haven't. I haven't. No, what, bro? You've got excuses. Yeah, don't well, watch nothing, bro. Well, like it's, it's cool, bro. Obviously, without giving spoilers, it's yeah, it's the energy's there, man. I thought same thing like you said, Carol. Like, yeah, why they're making more Peaky Blinders? Same thing I thought back then, Eve, because I thought I thought the third season was well, quite yeah. It's like that's what I thought as well. It, it, was, like, well. it, it yeah. was kind of unanswered, and I kind of liked that in it. Yeah, but yeah. I thought, what are they gonna do with this? And these first first episodes are just crazy. It's just like. No, he's just laughing throughout the whole episodes. That's that's how I was feeling. Yeah, cool. Eve is doing her thing. Vill- yeah. Villanelle is yeah. deserves an Oscar because <laughs> she's mad sick head and a good right now. Yeah. But yeah, I, and I genuinely believe she wants to be good, but she just doesn't. Uh... Nah, she's got she's got no empathy. She's got no. She's she's a stone cold killer, man. And that's yeah. the thing. It's, it's mad because oh, people oh. proper. Fans will love fans love her in it. Fans yeah. love that character. So it's, yeah. Like, yeah, we love this crazy serial sort type of person. But... Yeah, nice. Um, I'm I'm for it. I'm still enjoying it. Um, yeah, let's just let's just roll on Killing Eve, man. What's her name? Still one of my favorite characters, though. Um, uh, is it is it is it Catherine? Not Catherine, but Fiona Shaw's character. Oh, the the mum. Yeah. Yeah. Well, not the yeah. Yeah, she's her sense of humor is so dry and funny, man. Yeah, but we're still searching for the twelve. Yeah, we're searching for the twelve. Um, I'm hoping this is the last one, though. Yeah, yeah, it's true, man. I think it's come to its natural. I think if you go any further, you're stretching it. Uh, Definitely stretching it. Um, also, I'm not 100 sure what's going on BBC because Snowfall has been released. Oh, is it is that in yeah. America? Oh, shit. No, it's it's been released in America. Yeah, but over here it's not on BBC. Although I remember last time it, it took a while, right? Yeah, but it said on the thing that like, iPlayer was going to come out on the same day. But oh, I've it? been searching. Oh. Every time I, I get nil poire, the church comes back with return comes back with nil poire. Um. All right. Before we finish, guys, um, I'm going to ask you this question because maybe you'll know a better answer for me. What is going on with all these fucked up superhero shows? And in that, I'm talking about The Guardians <laughs> of Justice on Netflix. And I'm also talking about The Boys Presents Diabolical on Prime. I love Diabolical. I loved it, man. That was, did you watch it, Kyle? Oh, yeah. yeah, man, loved it's it. It reminded easy. me of, um, that was that show on Netflix, Robot, the robot when Yeah. You know, every, oh, every yeah. episode is different. And it shows a realistic point of, if you had powers, it just shows a realistic point of what you do with those powers and what people do when they get powers. Do you yeah. know what I, mean? <laughs> so I, I loved it, man. I loved it. I, you know, I feel sorry for the um, Aquafina episode. The, 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 oh, yeah. The, like, if you get a lot of stick for that, I'm like, that's nah, funny, man. It's funny, isn't it? Like, that's that's what the boys is about. It's just wacky, yeah, man. crazy. So, like, that's what, that's what I was saying. Like, if, if where people get angry with this series, it's like, this is just not for you to watch, isn't it? It's a yeah. particular sense of humour and, Hundred percent gratuitous violence. Not, not, and, yeah, not, not everyone yeah. will get it. Not everyone no. will get it. Yeah. No, but yeah, it's. It, have you ever seen um Happy Tree Friends? Who? Happy, Happy Tree Friends. No. Nah. Like, this is like some cartoon with like cute animals, and it's the same vibe, but just with cute animals doing some madness, bro. Serious. Like it's it's how, basically that whole series, especially that first episode, um, just reminds me of how Tom and Jerry could. Could have been, but take off all the filters off them. <laughs> like just violent to the core, man. But no, I did, I did, I did, I did enjoy it. I did. I liked all the different styles of animation as well. Uh, it's only, it's only, it's only fifteen minutes long as well, isn't it? Yeah, that's why I was, yeah, it was short, done, short. done like within two hours. Yeah, I've only watched the first. Two, bro. I'll be honest with you. I watched the first one. I watched the first oh, okay. one. Okay, yeah, that was good. The what, first what, one. What, what was Aquafina episode? Um, no. the, the the poo one, one, isn't it? The poo one. Oh, the pill one. No, the, yeah, the poo where where she was. Um, yeah, definitely not. Yeah. That, so. <laughs> 
Guys, I was almost I was the, the almost one sniffing. Not, no, the not. poo, like when she, when she went to the toilet. Like, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, cool. Definitely not for me, bro. I'll be honest with you. No, nah, it's not for everyone, but I enjoyed it a lot, man. I, I loved it. The, the Netflix one now, I tried. I, I watched two episodes. I'm like, it's like a Tarantino mixed with <laughs> some... <sighs> Thunderbirds mixed with some. It's 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 just weird, man. Oh, I don't I um I, I don't take drugs or anything. But this is how I would imagine what take drugs is like in it. Like, yeah, man. But, but you know what? I loved it, man. Oh, is I, it? I think I think once you, I thought, what the hell? This cheesy, crazy, just like it, it felt like some snuff porn movie sort of thing without the porn, obviously. But it it just felt weird, didn't it? And I thought. I, I get what you're trying to do. This is deliberate. This is supposed to be done. Oh, it's very deliberate. Very deliberate. Very and it was, it was just a mash of mixed media. You had animation, 3D, yeah. stop motion, every, every form yeah. of visual you can think of. And yeah. I, I actually enjoyed it. I mean, it's, it's kind of the same story that we've been seeing around when superheroes go dark, but they just told it in a very visual way. And it just, I liked it. A quick um, watch as well. Mm. Yeah, yeah I enjoyed cool. it. I enjoyed it. I mean, I'm not saying I've watched two episodes. I, I, I'm not giving up. I think I will finish it. Yeah, I'm not that turned off by it, but it's just, mm. it's just <laughs> you know, I, I'm watching whilst I'm working, and I'm like, huh? <laughs> yeah. So yeah, if you, yeah. If you put your head down, you put your head up. You're like, where the hell am I now? Yeah, you're like, mean? yeah, it's some yeah. next scene and blood, and you're like, huh? What, that, what happened? <laughs> kind of thing. Yeah, and I like, I like the whole like the whole Mortal Kombat sort of element they're having in the Yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> boss, the Great. boss is fight. Yeah, the boss is like, yeah. Mentality. Like. Some of it was all right, I'll be honest with you. But you know what it was? I, I, maybe if you one of you had watched it beforehand and like, I don't know, prepped me. Like, was, <laughs> but I mean, like, for what was about to come, I did, like, literally, I was, you know, like, I just like, rah, let me see what's going on. I watched the episode, I said, what the fuck? Then I watched the other one. I said, no, no, no. You know, like it was because I watched them back to back almost. Like I watched one. I said, I don't want to watch this. I turned on the other one. I said, yeah. no, no, this is too much for me. But you know, like you're flicking through Netflix and they, at, at that point, there was nothing for me to watch. I just turned off the television. <laughs> I've been listening to my audio book. I ain't gonna lie. I just started listening to my audio book. The whole television. Bro. Just lots of the whole television, bro. I just started watching, listening to my audio book. Right. It was, oh, it was, it was, and I, I hope there's a second season. I hope we don't get cancelled. Because I, I, I was kind of watching it thinking, I hope, like, oh, this is a one-off for me. I hope it just gets cancelled after the first season. But I, I really hope they renew it. Yes, Jupiter, Jupiter, that Jupiter Ascending thing or not? Ascending. Remember that, that yeah, series? Yeah, yeah, yeah that, yeah, that deserves yeah. to get cancelled. But this, um, I want, I want. It's just wacky, man. All right, well, yeah, that's one of them, like I said. Guardians of Justice on Netflix and The Boys Presents Diabolical is on Prime. Mm. Um, we're not going to talk about it this week. We'll talk about it next week because some of us clearly haven't watched it. But The Batman was released this week. Um, and who has watched it? It's just yeah. me and you, Merv. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not, no spoilers, yeah. But I went in there with high expectations and they delivered. Like... All right, you know, uh, for me anyway, this is for me, isn't it? For me, this is. Mm. I want to hear, 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 hear it. I want to hear it. I want to hear it. I want to hear it. You know, Nate fell asleep half a through. I know you did. For me, Sweet? no, nope. Watched it. For me, this is hands down one of the best Batman renditions I've ever seen. Hands down. Yeah. I. Then you could have shaved off. Could have shaved off thirty minutes from it, I... but like it, it was. I, I'm 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 so happy with their their choice of casting for um, Patterson. Patterson. Really? <laughs> yeah. Like, bro, he smashed it. You know what? And I, I feel, knew it. I feel That's like what I'm we, saying. Like, I feel like we should end the conversation here because I feel like <laughs> I feel like generally we should end the whole conversation here because Rich and Kelly watched it, and I don't want to do it. Like, I, I'm, I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna bite my tongue. But you so, guys got watching because we need full committed conversation around this. Yeah. So uh, uh, I'll go about my time. Go, go on, Rich. Go on, Rich. Say what you're no, going to no, say. say no, are say. we saying so? I'm not saying anything. Christian Christian Bell, is it? Is it out do Christian Bell? I mean, you were good at your you were good at your time, Christian, isn't it? But it's time for the R packs to to make way, isn't it? That's an R pack. No, I I I, <laughs> I am actually questioning 
was Merv watching the same film as me? <laughs> I'm actually questioning, was Merv watching the same film as me? But you know, but Merv's like, you know what? I, like, uh, Merv said this, and someone else said this too. Oh, and, and Merv's very critical of DC films and Batman as a whole. Yeah, you know exactly. what I mean? Yeah. So for him to sit and, and the other person as well that said this is, is uh, even worse than Merv. And he, what he goes, nah, man. He goes, he, the other guy said he went there with low expectations. So he said that he would have looked and and he was so like, what, what was the word he used? Um, pleasantly surprised. Yeah, yeah. Basically, he was pleasantly surprised, and like he's not, but he's not sure whether that's because he had very low expectations of the film, or whether he the film was that good. He's not too sure about, it, but basically, he enjoyed the film. He enjoyed it, and he enjoyed everything about it. All right. Well, I'm gonna leave it on that, on that, on that, because <laughs> I can't be, I, I, I can't hold my mouth anymore. <laughs> All right, guys, that was episode 131. Please come back next week for 132 where we actually dissect the Batman, okay? Because it needs dissecting. Mandem, if you haven't watched it by then, it's everything, everything is on the table. Just don't, don't show up. Don't show up. <laughs> yeah, the Batman. If you can't get to cinema, watch it on alternative platforms, whatever. Uh, like, no, no, nah, no, nah, no, nah, no. Nah, nah, nah. You watch this, I can't, you watch I this on IMAX that. if you have to. Yeah. I, can't, well, I, watch I, I can't do that. I, I watch it on no laptop, no phone Bitch, screen. Uh, no. I'll send you a link, bro. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> yeah, because you are, you are not fully geeked. Rich, Rich save um, your money, bro. Rich, save don't do it. No, no, yeah. shut up. Right, shut save up. your money. All right, guys. <laughs> save your money. Go and join the half geek pod, mate. Oh, save exactly, your money, man. boy. All right, guys, that's episode 131. All right, peace. <laughs> Big up. Peace. Big up.